What's up, my gang? It's your boy Jamal. We on the ground. So one day, we gonna shine. All right, y'all. Billionaire girl forced to get a job. What happens next is shocking. She probably was too spoiled and ruined it for herself, so her parents made her get a job. <sighs> just take it. They just go overboard. You give somebody an inch, they want to take a mile. I just don't get it, man. Let's go. All right. Dang. Here it is. <laughs> what do you think? Pretty cool, huh? huh? Seriously, Dad? A Porsche? A Porsche? A I told you I wanted a Rolls Royce. <laughs> Oh, Rolls Royce, hold on. You crying about, bro, that's a brand new Porsche truck. People just be too ungrateful for me, bro. I just, this is why I stay to myself, because people be too ungrateful. It'll, it'll drive you crazy. It'll make you really go crazy, like, for real. Man, I should have gotten her the cooling in. Are you kidding me? You spoiling her is why we're in this situation in the first exactly. place, Exactly. Can you imagine how excited we would have been to get a brand new Porsche for our 16th birthday? Exactly. <laughs> I would have been crazy excited to have any car at all. At 16, I was working at this soup kitchen, trying to save up money to buy a used Jetta. Exactly. There are so many children who get nothing. Yeah. yeah. Maybe if you would stop treating her like daddy's little princess all the time, she'll learn to appreciate something for once. Enjoy. Please let me know if there's anything else I can get you. Thank you. What is this? Uh, complimentary bread, ma'am. I know it's bread, genius. Where's your guys' brown baguette bread? That's one of the reasons why I came here in the first place. It's not a big deal, Victoria. I'm sure this one is just as good. No, I want the brown bread. Let me go talk to the chef. Yeah, you go do that. What? What? You're really not going to say anything? I mean, it... If she wants brown bread, you know, it's fine. It's her birthday. You did not have to be so rude. No. The waiter didn't do anything wrong. Yeah, he did. He brought me the wrong bread. She did not This is it. exactly what I want. Black on black. At least you got the color combo right on the Porsche. You know, your father was just telling me that when he was 16, he had to work in a soup kitchen to save up for a used Jetta. And I'm proud of him for that. Okay. So, what does that matter? <clears throat> We're rich now. We're rich. Because we worked really hard for everything we have. I'm glad she told me to her straight up like that. Hold on, who is... You're broke, love. Like, one thing I'm always tell my child is, you're broke. I'm rich. You're not rich. You're broke. I'm rich. Daddy is rich. Child is broke. <laughs> You have no money, child. Not because anyone gave us anything. Do you want a cookie or something? <clears throat> Mommy, what Mommy's trying to say is that you should be a little more appreciative of what you have. The Porsche is a really nice car. In fact, a lot of people would love to have a car like that. That's all. And why don't you try this bread? I'm sure it's delicious. Mm -hmm. No, I'm not trying it. I don't want to keep the Porsche. You want me to have the same car as every junior at Viewpoint? You're lucky I'm not asking for a Phantom. You should be lucky that you're not getting a used Jetta. No. Or having to work in a soup kitchen. Y'all shouldn't get her no Yeah, car. because that'd be so hard. If I can pass Miss Wiggins' English class, then working at a soup kitchen would be a breeze. You would not last a week in a soup kitchen, Victoria. Yes, I would. Put it to the top. All right, I'll tell you what. If I can work at the soup kitchen for the week, then you guys are going to buy me the colonin. Do they got their own soup you kitchen? You know, that's not a bad idea. She's going to work in a soup kitchen for a week and get a quarter of a million dollar car? What kind of a world are we living in? For real? I'm terribly sorry, but we no longer have the brown baguette. Then go find it. There's no way I'm eating this. Hey, we're so sorry. Bro, she can't do that? Can't they kick her out? Get this girl out of here, bro, please. She, she making me mad. Oh, she's stressing me out. This girl is stressing me out. Maybe working in the kitchen will humble her. 
<laughs> Hopefully. <laughs> Stressing me out. Thank you so much. Can you believe people actually eat this crap? Hey, I can take over the soup if you hey, want to just, just... She was just leaking out like, what you mean? I eat this crap. Oh my the bread. <laughs> Let me guess. Your parents are making you work here too? Uh, no. I've been volunteering here for years because... I just love helping people. Hi. Hey, Homer. Here you go. Enjoy. Thank you so much, Shelby. Yep. Thank you. And here you go. Dad, is it okay if I have one more bread? I'm really hungry. Um, oh. Sure, whatever. Have as much as you want. Actually, it's only one per person. I'm sorry. <clears throat> sorry, honey. They changed the policy, remember? Mm. Come on. What's the big deal? It's just Brian. She could have more. Well, trust me, I want to. But with the recent budget cuts, our funding is really being affected. And we have even less supplies now. If you give two pieces of bread, there won't be enough for everyone, unfortunately. <laughs> Thank you, sir. I had the chef find the brown baguettes for you. It wasn't easy. Yeah, we had to go to seven different her. stores That's just for you. Mm -hmm. Well, thanks. He always spoiled her. Mm, that's so yummy. Great. Okay. <laughs> so, honey, how was your first day? Oh, it was horrible. Mm. It stinks there and the manager is so strict. Mm. She wouldn't even let me use my phone. It's more like a prison than a job. So it was kind of like a prison just because you didn't get to use your phone? Are you sure you're going to last all week? Uh, for the clone, and yes. If it weren't for that, I wouldn't even be. It's here. What's here? What's here? Do you know anything about this? No idea. Please do not tell me you got another pair of designer shoes with our credit card. You already have too many. Not my bottoms. I need a plain white one. You know how many kids only have one pair of shoes? You don't need every style in every brand. Uh, yes I do. I'm gonna go try these on. She just be taking Oh, honey, you haven't even eaten your... She, wait a minute, she just... Oh, now, now you're getting in trouble. Don't just take my credit card without my, uh... Oh, yeah, she wild. She wild. Bread. Oh, she wild. No, no, she wild. She just got me all the way set up straight. Hey, Victoria. I'm just on my phone and there's not even anyone here. No, I was going to say that maybe you can pass out these crayons to each parent that comes in with a child. Someone donated these. Isn't it nice? Great. More work. Thanks. You know, Victoria, now might be a good time for you to take your lunch break before the rush comes. I just made a new batch of soup that Ew. maybe... No, I'm not eating that crap. My chef made me lunch. because at the place they the what happened okay, it's okay in here at least until we get home and then I can we'll put some crazy glow on it hmm? come on vamos she really only got one pair of shoes hey I was wondering if you guys were gonna come in today yeah we decided to wait until dinner, since the kitchen only allows one meal a day. So what are you gonna do for lunch? Uh, Here, have mine. Oh, no, 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 we couldn't. No, please, I'm not hungry. Honestly. That's nice though. Thank you. 
Thank you so much. This really means a lot to us. I want you to keep this. What is it? We're going to share it? And then we'll go to dinner. He said, we're going to share it and then we're going to go to dinner. Did y'all just hit a father? The father is hilarious. He said, we're going to share it and then we're going to go to dinner. I got those shoes, but I got the other uh, time. Oh yeah, she wowed it. Dad? Dad! She Your dad had some business, honey. What's up? How much longer do we have to stay in this dump for? My room and my closet are literally so small. This is not a dump. Do you know what people would do to live in a place like this? You know the renovations are going to be going on for probably a couple more months. A couple months? Are you kidding? This is going to be the longest summer ever. Stop ordering stuff. Here you go. Thank you. Of course. Thank you. And here you go. Yeah. So, are you excited? About what? After a day, it's officially been a week, so you don't have to do this anymore. Hmm. Yeah, I am. Shelby, could you come here for a second? Oh, yeah. It's her birthday today, and Sophia wanted to have you over as a thank you for helping us the other day. Wow. I really hope you can come. Sure, I'll be there. Great. We'll see you. Well, the little girl like her. At least somebody like her. Hi, you're just in time. I was about to start singing happy birthday. Come in um, at three, okay? One, two, three. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Sophia. Happy birthday to you. Bravo! <laughs> Did you make a wish? Okay, good. I'm going to go get your gift, okay? Please give Victoria some company. Again, thank you so much for being here. This really means a lot to us. What'd you wish for? Let me guess. Toys? New clothes? I know. A puppy? No, I'm good with what I have. I don't need anything else. Really? Well, not to be mean, but your shoes are kind of falling apart. You have to eat at a soup kitchen and... Your place is pretty small. Yeah, I know. But my dad always taught me to be thankful for what I have because there's always someone out there who has less. I could have no food to eat, no shoes, or no home. That's very, very true. Oh, Sophia, that's so true. And you're really smart for your age, you know? <laughs> so, what'd you actually wish for? For my dad to get a new job. He's been sad since he... All right. Open it. Well, you should have got some new shoes. New crayons? Thanks, Dad. I love them. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> I'm sorry I couldn't get you anything else, but, well... This father's stressing me, y'all. I know he's doing his best, y'all. I know, I know, I know. I know he's doing his best, but... Bro, she needs some new shoes. She needs some new shoes. You you were supposed to get her some new shoes. What is she going to do with them crayons? Oh, man. Dad, stop it. They're perfect. Thank you so much. You're welcome. She's a, she's a great daughter, though. She's very good. Do you love it or do you love it? Huh? Hey, God. You, know you got it for me? Hey, a deal is a deal, honey. And we're so proud of you for having completed your week. We are. Go check it out. You're a very lucky girl. Very So much. what do you think? It's... <laughs> ah, Y'all know what to do. Comment down below. Bless you. Y'all know exactly what to do. Do not sit up here and act like y'all don't know what to do. Y'all know what to do. Comment down below. Bless you. Y'all lucky we at the end of this video anyways. 
What would you like then? Damn it, she just had them deliver all that. I love this. And she got the girl some new shoes. Yes. Please take those shoes off. She, she learned her lesson. She did what she needed to do. She changed her ways. That's how it's supposed to be, man. But look, comment down below. More videos y'all want your boy to check out. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new. Smash the like button on this video. And I'll see y'all next time.